Our universe is filled with secrets and mysteries. What? What? With questions to be answered. We find ourselves searching for those answers. At the very fabric of science and society. And for the very first time, these worlds collide. On my mark. Here we go. Now it's dark. Topics that contribute knowledge to the society. News, interviews with guests. The show that said it all. With your host, Tarek al Barwani. Tuesdays at 5 p.m. Face it and talk it through on Knowledge Talk. Check it out. Every week here on the Nation Station Radio, South of Oman, 90.4 FM. Assalamu alaikum, good afternoon, and welcome to Knowledge Talks. A weekly entertainment and knowledge sharing program aired live specifically to share with you topics that contribute knowledge to the society. Every week, Knowledge Talks hosts and invites guests that are experts, professionals, and leaders from the field that bring wealth of knowledge to you. Knowledge Talks also highlights and promotes talents in the country that contribute knowledge and success to the nation. This program, ladies and gentlemen, is a weekly session that I will have with you every Tuesday at 5 p.m. I'm your host, Tariq Hilal Al-Barwani, along with our studio engineer, DJ Ayyub, for an hour bringing you free knowledge at your doorsteps on Oman Radio FM 90.4. Okay, stay tuned after this music break for today's interesting personality and today's interesting knowledge topic. Welcome back to Knowledge Talks, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, Tariq Hilal Al-Barwani, along with our studio engineer, DJ Ayu, with you here live today on Oman Radio FM 90.4. What would it take to open an exhibition at home and make a business? Well, my special guest today, Amel Al-Bulushi Om Yasin, is already an owner of Home Business Exhibition and is ready to share her journey and experience from exception to launch. What is a home ex- business exhibition? How can you benefit from it? And how can you launch one as well? Amal Al-Bulushi, the founder of Home Business Exhibition, is with us here today to share all that you know from challenge to solution. Amal is a mother of two beautiful boys, Masha Allah, and has a great supportive family who believe in her ideas, Masha Allah. She is always encouraged to do what she loves and yes, today she does what she loves. Amal worked for three years in Qatar Airways as ticketing reservation agent. And two years in Uridu in customer service and activation team and became a supervisor. MashaAllah. Amal decided to do something different with her career and journey of home business exhibition was born. Amel is going is going to support her home business owners and today she is with us here on Knowledge Talks to talk about her business and journey. Amel, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu and how are you doing today? Alhamdulillah, Tariq wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Thank you very much and um, I'm very happy I'm here in your show. Uh, thank you to having me here in your show. Uh, this is honor to be with you, and uh, I'm one of your big fan, and uh, I love uh, what you're doing and your support and your uh, positive energy what you're giving us. And uh, thank you. Masha Allah, Allah khaliki Amal. Amal, let me tell you something about you. I have worked with you uh, many years ago, and whenever I used to see you, mashallah, you are always brightening. Allah is khairu baraka, mashallah. <laughs> and you are also today even more brightening. But you know what I like about you, Amal, which I didn't see from other uh, uh, females and other ladies, is that the other ladies, I still work with them. I see them the same place. 
But you today, you have went out. You today created your own business. You today, you're boss of your own. And you today doing your own activity that you love. And what I would like for this program today, Amal, is to learn from you on what you're doing. And also to look at how were you able to leave office, mashallah, and do what you can do. Because I want all the other girls who are working now to say, I want to become like Amal. That's what we want to do. So, mashallah, thank you very much for coming in Masha today, Allah. Amal. Amal, mashallah, I've learned and I came to know about your uh, home business uh, exhibition on the Instagram. Yes. I was going through the Instagram and yes. then checking the pages. And then, mashallah, I saw all the pages and all the things that you do. And I asked my sister, hmm, who is doing this? And then when I came to know it was Amal, I was very, very happy. Okay. Tell us about your history and profile from... How did you start until you went and became and did the home business exhibition? Mm. Okay, first of all, like uh, you said before that I work, uh, I study IATA and I study customer service. And now I'm doing something uh, different. Uh, I work uh, in Qatar Airways uh, for three years. Okay. Uh, Okay, you're working in the Qatar Airways in the ticketing department? Ticketing department, ticketing okay. and reservation agent, okay. and then in Urido. Okay. And we work together. Okay, mashallah. And um, alhamdulillah, after that, I realized I want to do something else. Okay. Um, I don't like actually to work in office. Okay. I want to do something what I love okay. to do. And uh, I start with the home business. Okay, mashallah. Uh, yes, I was what I was doing uh, since three years before I start my home business, and uh, I I love to do a flower arrangement and um, a gift away things and uh, uh, gift for different um, like Eid gift and okay, uh, we have in Ramadan Karan Kashu gift. Okay, and so you create all this thing yourself? Yes, I create everything by myself mm. and then I have account also on Instagram Amelia1612. Can you give me the spelling of Amelia? Amelia A M E L I A uh, one six one two. One six one two. Okay. Yes. Mashallah. Uh, and you can go and see, have a look in my page. Yes. And uh, that's what I was doing. Mashallah. Since I three. actually saw them. Yeah. Okay. Ala uh, fikra, I did see them, and I like all the creative things that you do. I want to ask you a question. These you did them all yourself? Yes. Ha all uh, mm -hmm. handmade things. All all handmade yes. things. Mashallah. Yes. Now I want to ask you, how did you learn to do this? This is my hobby. This is what I love to do. Since what age? Ah, oh, since long time. Uh, since you were young? Yeah, since school time. Mashallah. Yeah. But, but do you learn anything about it or yourself you're just playing and you're... Yeah, no, 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 just playing and doing and uh, just uh, looking, searching about okay. new ideas. And uh, that's it. Mashallah, mashallah. And then you are now selling that to people. Yes. And people can come and buy those yes. items you're doing. Uh, uh, and they can see all the things from Amelia, your page. Yes. Uh, people can uh, go in my page and can uh, order okay. uh, what the, they like. Okay. And they can uh, call me or uh, talk with me at uh, uh, WhatsApp and okay. order. And uh, I can um, make it for them um, on two weeks, three weeks. On two, three, two, three weeks you can yes, do it for them? Yes. Now... This you started from three years ago? Yes. Okay. And still now I'm doing. And still now you're doing. Yes. Mashallah, Plus mashallah. the home business. Plus the home business. Yeah. Now, uh, this started from hobby. Yes. Do you believe that people who have hobbies can yeah. do business out of it? Yes. You have okay. to believe in yourself. You have to uh, give a value what you're doing. And, okay. Uh, uh, you have to use what you, Allah gave you. Mashallah. This is a, a hobby things, yeah. not uh, everyone have. True. And uh, what I, um, how I started actually, my uh, family they support me very well, and they was believing on me, mm -hmm. and especially my father. Mashallah. They always tell me, Amal, you have uh, you have very big talent Mashallah. and i believe on you and you ha you can do a lot of things Mashallah. and they just uh, like my ideas they like what i'm doing and uh, when uh, even i was uh, working in uh, in urido 
so many girls they was uh, they always say Emily you're different and you they like uh, when I wear something different when uh, they like my taste they like my style Mashallah. and they feel that uh, um, I'm creative Mashallah. I can yeah. tell you one thing from what I know uh, a lot of people that I know and a lot of people who also work in Uridu speak very big about you, mashallah. Oh, from your personality, from how humble you are and how nice you speak to people and how creative you are. And that is why today mm. I said, let me find where is Amal and invite you to our program <laughs> so people can learn from you. Alhamdulillah. Now, I want to go back to when you were working and then you decided to leave. Why, in your opinion, you think uh, 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 people don't prefer some people don't prefer to work and they do their own business why do you think so um, for example yourself you you felt that i don't want to be working for an office mm, uh, i prefer to do my yes. own activity why do you think so uh, because uh, i'm not giving in office that much and uh, i felt actually just to say that i'm not that person to can sit in uh, front of the computer long time yeah. i feel it's uh, boring okay and i'm not excited to do and I'm thinking to do th something what I love. Mashallah, and when mashallah. I uh, do something what I like, I can give more. And you can do more and yes. give more. Mashallah. Yes. And I feel I have in my mind so many things is going on, so many ideas going on. I just yeah. want to bring, in, bring them out and share with the people, uh, come see what I'm doing. Yeah. And uh, I like if I do something and I ask people, did you like it? Did you really like it? Did yeah. you, did, is it uh, really nice? Yeah. So when they appreciate this, uh, what I'm doing, and they say, yes, Amal, this is very nice. And they don't believe that I'm just making these things by my hand. Okay. And uh, they keep uh, encouraging me. Yeah. You have to do, you have to, some people, People and my family, they say, you just go and open a shop. What are you doing? You're sitting at home and making the things. I say, yes, inshallah, inshallah, I will do something. Mashallah. Yes. I really like how you have explained yourself and how you have also given me an understanding that people should work and do things that they like yes. instead of just going to the office yeah. and sitting over there and getting paid on doing something that you don't really like and you get bored as well. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, this is an exciting learning from Amal al who, mashallah, was working in a company, left the company, started her own business because she's passionate what she has to do. This is a great learning, ladies and gentlemen, for us to learn. Let us take a quick break, ladies and gentlemen, and revert back to our interesting discussion Welcome today with... Welcome back to Talks, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, Tariq Al Al-Barwani, along with our studio engineer, DJ Ayub, And today we have an interesting guest, Amal Abdul Rasul al Bulushi, a very exciting guest who speaks about her journey into uh, doing home business. Now... A very good point and input that Amal has said was, you know, Tariq, I don't like working in an office where I do something that I don't enjoy. And she said that I was working for two places. I worked for Qatar Airways and I worked for, and I worked for Uridu. Yes, they are good companies, but I like to do something that is useful and something that makes me happy. And ladies and gentlemen, one thing I can tell you is that if you do something that you are passionate about, then you will grow. If you do something that you like, then you will grow. And also, if you do something that you enjoy working on, then the number of hours doesn't become hours to you. Otherwise, you'll say, you know what? I come at work at 8 or at 9 and I stay until 5 or until 6 and it's really boring. That's what Amal said. It's boring. But because she does her own business, there is no time. Amal, tell me one thing. Yes. Do you feel the number of hours when you do what you're doing now? No. Not do, at all? Not at all. Do you believe if I have an order, yeah. I like, I prefer to sit in midnight yeah. after 12 uh, when the kids sleep and I just do uh, uh, those things, what I'm doing, uh, gift wrapping and arrangement and... Uh, I just sit as a long, very long time to do one things, and uh, you you don't believe maybe I will uh, sitting like a one hour. I'm doing arrangement, and uh, after like one hour, I will see no, I'm not uh, happy with it. I'm not happy with it. I want to change it, so I will make it again from the beginning okay until i was until uh, i felt no this is now looking very nice yeah so it'll take a really really long time to sit and do it but there's no problem you don't feel about that no no really, Mashallah, really Mashallah. I, I i really enjoy what i'm doing really 
mashallah. Now tell me one thing. I'm someone who's listening to the program right now, and I heard, okay, there is Amal, and she creates some things uh, like gift wrappings and gift gifts. I want to visit her page. You said it's the, you have an Instagram yes. account, which is Amelia uh, yeah. one six one, one seven one two w- one two one six one two one six one two. Yes, and then they come in. They can contact you via what WhatsApp. Or they can what? call me and they can WhatsApp. And every information is in the page. Yes, they Very can. Good. Uh, uh, no, the prizes. Uh, each thing is prizes is different. Okay. So they have to be in touch with me in a WhatsApp or they call me and uh, I can give them the details about the prizes and what I have to ask the customers what you like, what the color you want, Very good. Uh, how, um, what is your budget? Okay. Uh, is it the gift for girl or for boy, for okay. baby? Okay. For what the occasion actually? It's mm-hmm. Ramadan, it's Eid, it's wedding. So I need all these details. Okay. And um, after that, I, I, w- I have to work on it. Okay. And um, some some of the customers say, Amal, um, we are trust uh, we are trust on you. You just uh, make it uh, whatever you say. It's nice, and you just do it. And so there's this, some questions I have to ask the okay. customers, Very and good. after that, uh, I will able to do it. Well done. Though so there you go, ladies and gentlemen, a complete journey of how you can go from looking at what is available from a home business user contacting them asking them what they want and they ask you of course like what emily is doing and then you select and there where the transaction goes as far as ordering from a home business uh, uh activity Emil, tell me one thing now if a yes. company comes to you yeah and says Emil, i'm giving you a job and the desk you sit and we give you salary mm. will you join yes or no <laughs> Never. 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 And she said it twice. And then that means, and another never? <laughs> never. <laughs> <laughs> There you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's a very, very clear example that if you are passionate what you're doing and, uh, and, and also you can open a home business and do your activities and there is no hours to it. Now, I want to ask you another question as well. Yes. How about the number of hours? Uh, no, forget about the number of hours, but also contacting you. Can they contact you? What time? Okay. Uh, offices is eight to six. What time they can contact you? For the orders, for yes. the making things, yes. anytime. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Anytime. There you go, anytime as well. That is, is, is open uh, to for you to contact and ask anytime because that's how she is. She's always available to support you, to help yes. you yes. get whatever uh, you want as well. I'm going to tell you one thing. Now, I, I this the first activity of gift wrapping, mm. it, it is something that you have started three years ago. Yes. And you're very happy with it. Yes. And now you started something else. Yes. Which is the home business exhibition. Yes. Tell us about the home business exhibition, please. Yeah. Uh, first of all, when I did uh, the home business, okay. I'm the one, uh, one of them. Because there's uh, so many girls at home, their housewife or their sisters, they're just sitting. Oh, it's not all about like uh, their... Uh, all of them, they are house, uh, housewife. Some of them, they're working in office and they have um, home business. Mm-hmm. Uh, they're doing both of them uh, things together. Now, the home business, the idea, uh, it's come from that. Uh, I was thinking, like, uh, what, uh, what if we don't have like Instagram? Now, if we have, uh, like me, if I have home business and I only have the one way to sell my product, it's Instagram, just to do what I'm doing and take a picture and put it in my account and uh, people can see what I'm doing and they order. So what if we don't have Instagram? How the people will know me? How they will order? How they will uh, be in touch with me? So I keep thinking, uh, even sometime I see, I, I tell my uh, sister, uh, one day will come and this all social media will go away. And uh, so what people will do? So we have to think um, if this social media, we don't have social media. Uh, this what we was um, this long back. Uh, it was happening. It was, it was like there. that. There was no social yeah, media there was no for people to promote uh, yes. themselves and everything. Yes. Yes. So uh, the ideas came like uh, I want to help this uh, this 
people who want to put exhibition yes. their things. Yes. This home uh, business things yeah. that uh, the people doing at home. Uh, I want them to come out, let the people, more people know about them. And what they doing actually, Tariq, at home, they're doing, they're very creative people. Mashallah. They're doing everything but them hand. And uh, no, uh, there's no much people know, know about them. N- they don't know about them. Uh, do you know that we have people, they have experience more than 10 years. They're doing bukhur, they're doing lotions, they're doing oils, they're doing socks. Here in Oman. In Oman. Masha, they, these people do everything themselves? Themselves. Bukhur and everything. Everything, themselves. everything. Wow. And they have experience, like okay. 10 years. Masha Allah, Masha Allah. Uh, Yes, okay. and they're very, very good. Okay. Uh, it's not um, people have idea like uh, if it's home business, mm. maybe the product will be cheap. Maybe yeah. it will be not the quality. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but this is wrong. So this is only perception of people. Yes. So you think every product that uh, uh, that people are doing at home from Bukhur, you said. Mm. Uh, lotions, lotions, perfumes, uh, oil. Oils, all these people are doing, you think they're good quality? Yes. But Some. Not, uh, I I don't know about all of them, but, but what some I, of them are. yeah, but some of them they are very very good. And done here in Oman. Yes, they what? are all Omanis. All Omanis. They are all Omanis. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a fantastic information where you see there's a lot of product that is available out there, and it is done by locals here in Oman. Omanis are doing them, but no, most people don't know because you go to you know to care for city center and so on and go for all those brands that are out there, only to know that something of similar thing is available outside cheaper and of quality and you know what mashallah 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 amal abdul rasul al bulushi is here out to create a platform a solution for you to put your products for others to know and what i like about amal ladies and gentlemen is this amal says i know there is a lot of people of armani's there that have a lot of things and she has created home business exhibition for you to go and put your products with her so others can know. Is that what you're doing? Yes. How many events have you done so far? So far, only one. Okay. Yeah, last month, 1st of April. MashaAllah. Uh, the idea actually came, Tariq, like uh, I was, uh, I did a small meeting with my family and okay. cousins. Okay. Uh, one of my cousins' house. Okay. Uh, she was Mariam. Hi, Mariam. And uh, she uh, welcomed to me, uh, welcomed me, and she said, Amal, uh, they, they all believe on me, Tariq. They all believe, like, uh, Amal, she's creative. Uh, she can do, she have self-confidence. And um, I say, Mariam, I want to do a meeting. I want you, all my cousins, to be, um, just just sit and uh, I want to share my idea with you. Uh, she say, Amal, come and we'll sit and we'll talk. So we met, uh, we did a small meeting uh, at her home and I shared my idea with her and they was, uh, they said, it's very nice, let's do it. They helped me and uh, they say, we all with you, Amal. Whatever you want to do, we all with you. Uh, my family support was with me since like I'm born. Okay, mashallah, Yeah, mashallah. mashallah. I'm blessed, Tariq, with a wonderful, wonderful family. Um, they always, always with me. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Allah yahfudhum. Ameen, ya So, um, they, um, I, I was very happy. I said, okay, I share my idea with them. They welcome. They said, it's very nice. Let's do it. So, it started like, uh, like uh, from the family. Then, it's uh, come a little bit out. Family, friends, uh, neighbors. It's got. Uh, it's gone like that. Then, uh, then I we suggest to do a small market at home. Actually, we was facing a problem that we are looking a place to do the our small market at home. So my cousin say, Emil, don't worry. My house is open for you. You just come and do it whatever you want and we all with you we will all support you and this was very very big things for me to start from my uh, like my sister house Mashallah. and uh, alhamdulillah it was very successful alhamdulillah. and we did it and it was something very big Mashallah. and from the house uh, I start to doing and um, I'm 
And then I, I told them, what about if I will put an uh, advertisement mm -hmm. in social media, mm -hmm. let the people know more about home business, mm -hmm. and will invite more people to come to see what we are doing inside house. Mashallah. And uh, let the people come. Uh, to see and join us and buy and see the product and what we are doing and um, all this we did Mashallah. then alhamdulillah it was very successful and you know uh, when i put the uh, advertisement on the instagram um, i received so many calls okay. from all people ml please we want join ml please take us we want to be in your market and mashallah was uh, something i was very happy then Tariq, i was shocked like this much home business is going on in our country and we don't know mashallah. then i uh, then they uh, told me like uh, in one um, in one house mm -hmm. there's a uh, more than one or two people they're selling home business wow. like for example the mother she's selling food mm -hmm. and the daughter she's selling like uh, abayas or uh, shiel or buhu or something Mashallah. so they all uh, end of the day helping each other mm -hmm. and uh, that was wonderful experience uh, for me then uh, after the uh, actually the place at home a little bit was not enough to select uh, so many people uh, so I uh, it was like I took only 28 uh, people with me uh, I arranged for them um, tables the place uh, uh, snacks and rings and it was on Friday 1st April uh, from 4 to 9 okay and I, it was all free, Tariq. MashaAllah, mashallah. All free. Mashallah. You just bring your things and um, put it in a nice way and you just sell. And yet, Plus, so, yeah. I will bring the customers for you. MashaAllah, yes. MashaAllah. Ladies and gentlemen, there you go. An opportunity for you to demonstrate your activities for the females who are at home. And they have, they're have they creating very beautiful things and they want to know where to go and get it. Here you got uh, an entrepreneur, MashaAllah, uh, Amal, who comes out and created a platform for you. You can display your things, you can sell it, and she gives you everything from the table and the setup and gives you all advice. Amal Abdul Rasul Al Bulushi, mashallah. Tell me one thing. My name is Tarak. I want to come and I have things with me. Yes. I've created. I want to come advertise. Give me the whole plan from how to contact you. Yes. How to bring my things and what are the things you ask me? For example, uh, what are the things I can I can uh, I sell? can sell? Yeah. yeah uh, uh, I'm a computer guy. Can I sell a computer? I'm just joking. <laughs> anyway, but I want you to tell me the whole thing so yes. uh, someone who's listening yes. can learn how to give me the whole yeah. journey. Uh, it's uh, very easy, Tariq. When uh, whatever you selling at home, whatever you like to bring, it's okay. Even if you're not selling a product you want to do a uh, advertisement uh, for example uh, you're doing something in IT okay you want to uh, do a uh, advertisement to uh, to make the people know more about you okay okay you can you can join us okay and we will give you a table Okay. You put your business card, you put okay. your things, okay. and when the customers come, mm -hmm. you just give them the, uh, the information, what you're doing, and you give them your business card, they will be in touch with you. So it's not about only you have to sell something. Mm -hmm. Even you want to do advertisement on what you're doing, it's fine, you can join us. Mashallah. Yeah, no problem. When is the next date? The next date, inshallah, will be then after the first success, which I which did. Which was the first of April, was yeah, a successful one? Yes. I, uh, so many girls, and uh, they was participate in my exhibition. They said, Amal, you have to do something again, and we all will be with you. Mashallah, yes. mashallah, mashallah. Yes. And uh, mashallah, until now, I have 40 girls. They're okay. doing home business mm -hmm. and they want to join me mm -hmm. and they're just requesting me to do again something, yeah, 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 exhibition. So now I decide to do something a little bit uh, professional way okay. and a little bit big, big. 
Okay. And I just uh, book uh, for them a hall. Okay. And uh, I arrange everything for them. And uh, this time it'll be inshallah on 20, uh, 28 May okay. on Saturday. Okay. Uh, uh, the exhibition only for one day from um, 10 morning to 10 evening. Okay. Um, it'll be continue. Okay. Okay. And uh, this time I'm doing something a little bit uh, new idea. I came with new idea. Mm-hmm. And plus, I want to take more girls to be participate in my okay. exhibition. Uh, first time, it was only 28. And now, inshallah, I'm looking more than 50 girls wow. will be in my exhibition. And everyone, they're selling a different kind of the products. Mm-hmm. Um, and they have really new idea. Mm-hmm. Uh, that they're doing really new, new things at home. Mm-hmm. It's not about uh, every time we can see Bukhur and Abaya and no. This time, if you come in my exhibition, you will find uh, new ideas and uh, you will be surprised everything uh, they did at home. MashaAllah. That's amazing and that's very, very interesting yeah. to learn uh, uh, Amal and inshallah we hope to see the next event successful as well. Ladies and gentlemen, let's take a quick break and revert back with Amal to learn about her exciting journey in home business. Amal, you know, today you have inspired me because I really love what you're doing. And now I know for my retirement plan, maybe I should do home business as well. <laughs> Can we, you and I do business, inshallah? Yeah, please, Yeah, Mark. but I need you to teach me. To teach me like what we've learned, and I hope we will have many home businesses in Oman. Inshallah. And let all of them to know, mashallah, Amal Abdul Rasul Al Bulushi has helped us to do this. Amal, tell me one thing. Yeah. We have only about 15 minutes left, mm-hmm. and I really love learning and listening from what you're saying. Mm-hmm. But I've got a few questions before I end up with the program. Yes. Uh, I want to know first thing what is you are expecting to be the new things in your new exhibition compared to your older, the one you did on 1st of April? What, what, what new things are we expecting to see? Yeah, new things uh, we have now big place, we're doing outside, we're doing in a hall. Oh, mashallah, okay, very inshallah, good. Inshallah, we'll do it in Jamia al Mar al Omaniya. Awesome. On Oman 20, Women Association. Yes, okay. on 28th of May. Okay. Uh, inshallah. And um, the new mm-hmm. ideas is that now I can, uh, for. Uh, for the home business girl, they can join us. Uh, I can take more than uh, before okay. because we have a big place now. And uh, inshallah, we'll arrange for them a lunch meal. Awesome. Yes. Okay. Um, and now inshallah, we'll do home food, okay. more home food and things and products. And um, I will bring this time uh, uh, Omani food in my uh, exhibition. There's a home business. They're doing Omani food. They're really, really delicious and oh, very they're nice. very good. So and you're supporting all the yes. home uh, businesses, Omanis yes. who are doing the activity. Well done, yes. well done. Okay. I just want to say something. Um, our exhibition, it will be on 28th of May, like uh, after exhibition, after one week of our exhibition, it will be Ramadan. So please... Uh, Come and visit us, and you can buy something for Ramadan. You can Mashallah. buy something for Eid. Very so good. this is very nice chance to come and visit us and see our exhibition. And uh, inshallah, there's just so many things going on in my exhibition, like uh, surprises I'm doing. Okay. Tarek, I don't want to tell you now. Awesome. You Looking have forward. to come. Inshallah. You have to come Inshallah. and see there what I will. I uh, will. Uh, do and the surprise uh, yes you have, uh, because um my exhibition will be actually Tariq for families inshallah. for the all family there's okay. something i will do for kids okay, okay. and uh, there's a food there's Omani food and there's uh, much more okay so inshallah when you come you will see i'm very much looking forward now tell me one thing in order for you to do this Definitely, you need support. Yes. Uh, is there any kind of uh, uh, support you're looking in order to do this? Because I know you're doing it for free and you're trying to support people and you're trying to help people. Yeah. Uh, but is, is there kind of, uh, or are you working with some organization or something? No, right now? nothing. Just all, mm-hmm. all, all what I'm doing, it's uh, only 
yourself myself from your own personal expense yes mm -hmm. all this is all myself and what i need i wish uh, any company to support us to help us i need uh, advertisement i need um, uh, marketing and i need this uh, companies to know about home business to support us to see what uh, we really doing inside the home and there's uh, so many nice things coming out and uh, we need them supposed to this helps you know i i love what you're doing Salaha, mashallah because this gives opportunities for people to work yes. if they say there is no work no now you can create your own work yes and you can go and exhibit so people can know about it and they yeah. can pay for it so you can make money and so this is very good yeah. i really respect that and i like that uh, very much thank you tell me one thing uh, every person uh, have a role model or yeah. someone that they uh, 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 respect uh, for their support and so on. Do you have a role model? Yes, definitely I have. I have my brother-in-law. MashaAllah, okay. He's Abu Isra. Abu Isra, assalamu alaikum. MashaAllah, He's listening mashallah. to me, okay. Mahmoud Sakhi al-Bilushi. MashaAllah. Uh, he's the one, uh, he supports me in every and each thing what okay. I'm doing. And I learn a lot, a lot, a lot from him. And he's the one who guides me. And uh, actually, he I learned the business from him and okay. marketing from oh, him okay. That's and nice. the management from him. Mashallah. Uh, mashallah, everything in my life I learned from my brother-in-law. Okay. And even my dad, he gave me a push. He believed on me. He's... Um, uh, he believed on me that uh, I'm very talent, talented. Talented, yeah. Yes. Mashallah. And... Uh, uh, he just wish I'm I do something for my life. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And he believe I can do it. Yeah, and I'm sure both of them, uh, your dad and your brother-in-law, are very happy with you. Mashallah. Yeah, alhamdulillah. For what you have achieved right now, may Allah zidu khairu baraka dami ya rabbil alamin. Amin. What is your future plans? Amen. Inshallah, future plan. If it's go well, Tariq, and we got our support from the companies and. Uh, 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 the the companies okay the company has supported, uh, supported you, you yep. support me yeah and I'm looking inshallah I will do each year will do uh, once a uh, home business uh, exhibition, exhibition mm -hmm. and each year we will come with new ideas and with big place and with more people and uh, uh, because really uh, Tariq just uh, home business things the people who are doing home business they're very simple people they can't afford they can't afford uh, they can't pay too much if to just uh, participate in uh, Exhibition. uh, exhibitions there's so many exhibitions going on in our country but they are really expensive okay yes okay so we just looking to uh, support uh from them from the companies uh and that's it to just help those uh the families the people doing home business and uh, we can charge from them a, a small amount but uh, not that much because they really can't afford okay okay masha anything you wish to share to our listeners before the end of our program today uh, I want to share uh, my beautiful uh, woman uh, and sisters. They are sitting at home. Even they're working. They have home business. Mm -hmm. Please believe on yourself and be proud on yourself. And don't feel shy if somebody asks you, is it this home business or you have shop? Uh, the most of people, they shy. They say, this is home business. So please be proud of yourself and believe in yourself and love what you're doing. And um, uh, in home business, it's... Uh, it's an exciting thing to do. Yes, and really. It is, and, and, really. And it, if you, I'll tell you one thing, Ahmed. If you were able to do it, you were working in a big company, mashallah. You worked in two different companies, mashallah. And then you moved out to do something that you love. 
and you are very happy with it and i can look at you right now you have big light coming out of you mashallah mashallah i'm sure all the girls can do as well as long as they're passionate yes. they're confident and they're strong about it yes they have yeah. only tariq believe in themselves okay and we 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 actually have a caller someone has just called right now oh, for really? you contact yes hello hello yes uh good evening um I I was just listening to the interview. Am I on air already? Yes, you are on air already. Is it Mr. Tariq? Speaking indeed. How are you doing? I'm doing very well. In fact, I can't hear you. It's very faint. Okay, can you hear me now? Hello? Hello, are you driving a car? Yes, I'm trying to put my earphones on. Ah, okay, because probably be be, be careful. <laughs> yes, of course I'm careful. No problem at all. I'm I'm on I'm on hands off, but I'm I'm not able to hear you. You are you are very important. We don't want to lose you. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to know, in case if I wanted to get in touch with uh, her, you know, and yes. I want to uh, get some of my friends online. I mean, uh, on the exhibition with her. What do awesome. we do? Okay, uh, she's gonna share it with me right Hello? now. Amel, Amel, please go ahead and share. Uh. Hello. Uh, hello. Yes, my friend. Uh, I have an account in my Instagram. Hello. hello. I can't. She can't hear me. Okay. We, uh, I guess we lost. We lost the line. But Amel, can you please share uh, the question that she asked? And I'm sure a lot of people want to know. Yeah. How can they reach you in order to work with you and to also advertise? Can you please share? Yes, I have a page in my Instagram. A uh, home business exhibition, uh, and I'll put uh, my. Um, my account my, my account name and my pages uh in all social media so and my number if uh, you want to contact me so your phone number and everything is available on yes, your social media yes, page yes what are the social media pages so people can contact you the ones uh, right you? now only i have instagram what is the account name the account is named home biz home business exhibition home business exhibition, exhibition. so it's home mm-hmm. underscore business underscore exhibition yes Okay, good. So that is your account, and you also have Amelia for gifts. Yeah, for gifts. Yeah. Okay, so those are the ways people can get yes, hold of you. Yes, and please, uh, who looking forward to me, you have to wait. Inshallah, first uh, of May, I will put um, advertisement. Uh, anybody, anybody want to be a uh, participate in my exhibition? Uh, after my advertisement uh, you can uh, call me or uh, be in touch with me so i can put your name in my list and uh, uh, inshallah you will be in my exhibition with me but everything uh, again i want to say it have to be a uh, home business my own business yeah Amal, thank you very, very much for joining us today on Oman Radio FM 90.4 to share about your success in the world of home business exhibition. I take this opportunity to wish you and your family the very best and success at all times. Saraha Amal, you made us all happy. I am very, very happy to thank know you, you as my friend and also as a, someone who is, mashallah, doing very, very good for the society in Oman. Thank and you. I wish you the best at all times, inshallah. Thank you, Tariq, for having me on your show. Thank you very much. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we've come to the end of our program for this week. I hope you all had an intriguing time with us. Let us catch up again next week on Tuesday, same time, 5 p.m. for a knowledge session. I'm Tariq Hilal Al-Barwani, along with our studio engineer, DJ Ayyub, wishing you all happy and a pleasant week. Ma'as-salama. Ah.